Hello and welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to install IntelliJ on your computer. So to install the IntelliJ, we first have to download it. Simply open your favorite browser and then type IntelliJ IDEA in the search bar. And once you see the results, make sure the results are from JetBrains and then click on download here. And then it is going to take you to this page where you are going to see two versions of IntelliJ. One is called Idea Ultimate. It's a paid version. We will not be using this one. The other one is called Community Edition. This is the one that we will be needing. It's a free tool and it has everything that we will be needing. So simply click on download button here and then it's going to start the download process. Now, I have already downloaded it on my computer. So I'm not going to download it again. Uh, once your download is complete, simply double click this file and it will start the installation process. So click on next, next, and then click on install. Depending upon your computer, it might take a little while. So let it complete. Once the installation is complete, I will be back and I'll guide you further. All right, so installation is complete. Simply click this box and then click on finish. This will start the IntelliJ on your computer. Again, if it is uh, your computer is slow, it might take a little while because it has to do all the setups and everything. Now, once you do this, you might be presented with this window or you might see another window that might look something like this. If you are presented with this window, simply click on new project and then you are going to see this other window. So uh, here we have to give the name for the project in an IntelliJ before we can start working with any Java code, we have to go and create a project. So let's call it Java basics and then in front of build system make sure it's maven and in front of jdk make sure it's corito 17 now if you do not see this corito 17 you can click here and then you can click on download jdk and from here select 17 and click on ok once you do that simply click on the create button and this will start the installation of the JDK and it will start the project for you. Now, when you are doing it for the first time, it has to set up a lot of things. You can see the progress on, on here in the bottom of your IntelliJ. For example, right now, it's installing the Amazon Corito on my computer. After downloading it, it will install it and then it will refactor it. And if your computer is slow, it might, uh, it might take a little while. So let it complete. Once uh, it's done doing all of these things, I'll be back and then I'll guide you further. All right, so everything is complete now and this is the view that I see. If you see this pong.xml, it's a very important file. Please do not touch it, simply close this. And after that, you will be able to see this main.java and you might see this uh, worst new IntelliJ as well. You can close this one as well. So simply click here and then Click on this curly bracket, this will expand it and then just click on the run button and after that, you should be able to see your output in the console. So for example, I am trying to print hello world with the help of Java and I see my output here. If you also see your output or whatever you have here, if you see the same thing here and if you do not get any red errors, that means all went well and you are good for your first class. If you face any issues or if there are any errors or anything, please take the screenshot of that error and post it in the support channel inside Discord and our team will assist you. Take care. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one.